counter. Is it? All right. 11.59. Friday. Me and the boy are going to do 24 hour challenge on the boat. Just water. Uh, we got water in the cooler. Another thing of water here. And a couple of big jugs here. Um, basically, 24 hours. Um, only what we can catch is what we eat. And what we're going to be doing is catching some shrimp with the cast net first. So, we're going to try starting out with that. Um, as long as we can catch some of them, then we'll have live bait and we can eat those for dinner and hopefully have fish to go along with it. Yeah, so we're going to time lapse some parts because they might take a while. So, and we don't want you guys to like take 50 hours just to watch the video. But we got to get fueled up. Yep. We have this bag has some clothes, sleeping bag for him, sleeping bag for me. And then we have water and some fish and tackle. And our and that's it for the, for the night. So we're gonna get fueled up yep. and go to our first spot. Uh -huh. See what we get into. And I might be the cameraman just while we're going like out to the spot that we're gonna be at for the 24 hour challenge. I'll just have to figure it out. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoy what you're watching here today. Stay tuned. Black after a few minutes, after a few seconds. Um, how do I turn it back? Just touch it. Oh, there. <laughs> Sorry guys, the screen turned black for me, so I didn't know where it was looking. So yeah, right now we're at the ocean. We're just going out. Trying to find the spot that we want to be at. It's nowhere close to here right now. So we're going to go out a little ways. And we'll be to the spot we want to be at. Bye. See you when we get there. Oh. Hey guys, welcome back. So, you see this dump line right here? What we're going to be doing is tying off to it, and we're going to spend the rest of the 24 hour challenge right there. But first, we're going to go fishing somewhere up here. And I thought it was going to take a while, but actually, no, it took like a few seconds. So, yeah. We're going to be fishing up here somewhere, I don't know where, but as you can see, there's like tons of stuff that we have to avoid, because, yeah, um, and the duck line is all the way back there, so we'll be back right as we get to the Wait, did you turn the camera on? Yep. So guys, we just did one net throw. I'm going to be practicing after we just did that. Oh, there's a shrimp. Grab him. Oh. Grab it and put it in the cooler, Bubba. Oh, oh. Watch, they have. It. Just grab him by his tail. Is he good? Ow. Grab him by his whiskers. Pick him up. Yep. Throw him in the cooler on the ice. We got one shrimp. Wait, I didn't put him on the ice. That's okay, as long as he's in there. He's under the ice. <coughs> <laughs> Let me, I'm going to throw a couple more. Wow. That was the first shrimp on the first try. What? Come, come over here uh -huh. and videotape with your chest cam because I'm going to go up here and throw it. So what do I do? Just turn, turn your chest cam on and videotape that way. Oh, seen a couple of them. Uh, oh, might have got some. Uh, might have got some. Got some more. Oh, got one. I saw him in there. I don't know where he went. Is he at the top? Nope, I lost him. Oh, there's a shrimp. What? Okay. 
Okay, we're gonna find out where that one is. There he is. This way. There we go. Shrimpy. Not yet. It didn't open enough, but that's okay. You can try it again. You can grab that last. Yep. Like that. There you go. It almost opened. crappy throw but there's three shrimp we might actually eat tonight how about that come here here Baba I got three yeah yeah three and one I got lucky I got something in there. Shrimpy! And a couple of them. Two, three. Just three. I have the container. Where did you put the container? Oh, it's not guys. Um, okay. So I'm going to be putting some shrimp, these shrimp, this one fish, into the cooler. So, yeah. Um, now we have, um, I gotta get him back. Okay. Now we have 11 in there. And 12. 13. And 14. Okay. Dad. Now we have 14 shrimp. Okay, I got one more. Nice. I have this camera going. So is the generator done? No, I just shut it off because I want to talk to him. Oh. Got some more to add to the to the pot here. How many the is there? Last couple throws. There's six more in there. Oh, we're gonna have 21. Because right now we have 15 plus six is 21. Mm. What happened? Fish bent the rod over. How did I not catch that fish? What is going on? Jesus. Good. Are you mad? Yeah. That was our dinner. 
Got another fish, guys. <laughs> I see. Hurry. Hurry, Dad. Hurry. Let me see if it's a croaker. <gasps> what is it? A little croaker. Yes! Uh, I'm back with the tripod. We have one, two, three. Where's the fourth and fifth? They're probably under the ice. Well, we have fourth and fifth. So now, all we need is one more, guys. And then we'll anchor her off at that one. But it, you can't even see it. It's so far. Wait. <laughs> He's catching something. We have five, sir. No, we have six. This is definitely enough for us to... Now we have seven! We have seven croakers. And now we can head off to the duck blind. Face the cam. We're gonna go get tied off. Uh, duck blind over here. Tie off to the duck blind and then anchor off the back of the boat so that throughout the middle of the night we don't drift and uh, end up in low tide or in trouble. But we're gonna get all unrigged here and uh, head out. The boy's ready to eat. All right, come down. <laughs> hey guys, we're back. Um, right now, well, we are. Bring it over here, Bubba. Oh. So what we're doing right now, guys, is my dad's just cutting the fish. We're gonna clean up dinner. our clean up our dinner here. A couple small croaker. I had two. Oh, here. All right. So this is our dinner for tonight. This was two croaker that I cleaned. I started cleaning them before I realized that I wanted to show everybody our dinner. And then this bowl of shrimp here. There's 21, 20 or 21 shrimp in there. 21. And I remember how much we got from over there. We're going to take the heads off of these and do a little boil and seasoning. Back up. Back up. Oh. We're going to take the heads off of these and do a little boil. Seasoning. I got some seasoning here, and I brought my jet boil. So we're gonna do a little shrimp boil with them, and then I have oil and some uh, like Zatarain's fish fry, and we're gonna fillet up the croaker and throw them in the fish fry, and throw them in a little bit of oil, some golden crispies, and then we're gonna set our tent up and chill out, relax. So for the shrimp, what I do right here at the flex, I just pinch, pull, it deveins them, chuck the head, drop the shrimp in, go to the next one, pop it, devein it, Why is there so many drop whiskers? it in the bowl. Oh, that one's still. Is he still alive? No, it left the vein. It's okay though. We're gonna boil them. If you, if these shrimp were still alive, it must hurt real bad. We got our fillets, the old bag of, bag of magic. It's okay. That's how it's all. Shake them up. It's a little windy, so I don't know what this wind's gonna do to my grill. But we're gonna get some oil going here in a minute. And uh, fry these suckers up. Got the grease going. Yeah. So that means the bottom of it is. It's okay. There's our uh, 
Survival challenge dinner, fish, shrimp. The only I eat, he has six. The only downfall or survival is no no tartar and just some water. But tartar sauce. So for your shrimp, but take your shrimp. Yeah. You rip the legs off. tent right now this is the little one man walmart special except we got, somehow we're doing a two man <laughs> we got a sleeping mat down here we each got uh we got a sleeping mat down here we each got our sleeping bags changed into our pjs it's going on it's 8 30 i think almost nine o'clock um we had a good dinner mm -hmm. and we're gonna go ahead and Plus, we had fun setting this up. Yeah, it was interesting setting this up. <laughs> uh, but we got it set up on the boat. And we're going to go ahead and rack out for the night. And catch back up with you in the morning. Oh. Morning, folks. 6.40 in the morning. The boy's awake. He went out to pee. I wasn't ready to be awake, but I guess we're waking up. We're gonna get this tent packed up. <sighs> Head over to the beach. And draw, Do some and swimming. Park the boat and get off for a few. Swim and then, and then uh, right after we're done swimming, we. We'll catch some breakfast. Yep. Then we're going to try and catch some breakfast. God, there's a lot of fish around here. So, I'm going to get dressed and get this day started.
Well, time to try and catch us some breakfast. Just a couple bottom rigs set up here. Target and Kroger. Spot. Something. Um, oh, there he is. Is he on there? I don't think so. Oh, they're here. Get me about four croaker real quick. We'll have breakfast. Let me get this other pole set up. Well, maybe not. Oh, let's see what's happening here. See if this guy's gonna eat. I had him. Come on, hook yourself. There you go. Are you hooked? Yeah, you're hooked. That's how we need to do it. A little weak fish i gotta check the size regs on him real quick because i'm not sure Gray trout, 12 inches. Nope, can't keep them. Come on, keeper. What do we got? What do we got here? Little croaker. breakfast got a couple of croaker in one spot um, just enough for us to eat I'm not taking any home so we're gonna throw these in some um, breading make us some golden crispy real quick enjoy some breakfast and then just kind of chill for the rest of the day Plus 
aiming going right on our side. Look at this. We're aiming ourselves up. What the heck? Start eating dinner. Oh. <laughs> well, it's hot. Ah. Did you not remember? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, they can see me. That's pretty much it for the survival challenge. We made it. We got like an hour left. So we gotta be back at the dock. Uh, a little food in our bellies. So we're gonna start to clean clean the boat up a little bit and uh, mosey on up back over to the dock. We'll catch back up with you when we get docked up and start to head out. Well, that's it folks. Finished up 24 hour challenge. Uh, made it back to the dock. Wind's starting to pick up a little bit. And we're gonna go ahead and hose this boat down because it's a mess right now. And get out of here and find us something good to eat other than croaker and shrimp. And, uh, overall success. Made it. Ate some food. Had some fun. Boy enjoyed it. So, got anything to say, Bubba? Nothing. Nothing. Well, thanks for watching. Catch you on the next one.